wall detailer. Very decent trimmer. Not the best. Definitely not perfect. But it's a good trimmer. And it's worth. And I. These things are cheap. I think they charge like. I'm pretty sure it's like 50 bucks. Maybe $55. For. Basically. The number two. Trimmer on the market. In my opinion at least. And. I've tried a lot of them. Okay. This is a rotary motor that makes it pretty different most barbers use magnetic trimmers i'd say 80 or 90 percent of trimmers used in the barber industry are magnetic okay that's what a magnetic trimmer looks like this one here is custom made by my man uh manny here but uh yeah that one's a skeleton anyways but this is a rotary. Let me show you what a rotary motor looks like. Okay, now this is a heavy duty rotary. That's not a trimmer, it's a uh, hair clip, detachable hair clippers. Yeah, Oster Turbo 111s. Now here's the wall retro. You guys might recognize that right there. Um, and that's what the rotary motor in that one looks like. Okay, so now the detailer is nowhere near as powerful as that. I mean, that, that thing's like a car engine. But it is way, way more powerful than these. Anyways, um, it's a good trimmer. 1 to 10, I'd give it an 8 based on performance. You know, it's uh, my number 2 trimmer. Aside from the uh, Andes, GTX, and T-Outliners. It's got a great price. It's very powerful. Cuts like a lawnmower. I did not zero gap these. And as a matter of fact, I might stop zero gapping my trimmers. You know, uh, every trimmer I have is very sharp. You know, and uh, that's getting old. These, I'm heavy handed. Now, these, I did not zero gap them. They are, uh, you know, straight from the factory, who seems to be doing a pretty good job at adjusting their blades. You know, they don't seem to be doing a good job at much else, though. But, uh, yeah, so, I like them. Real decent. They, you know, when you cut hair, bald out someone, or, uh, do an edge up. It doesn't get all the hair in the first shot. But neither do these. But these cut a little bit closer. And maybe uh, less strokes than the detailers. I want to say the detailers two to three strokes and you're finished whereas the gtx and t outliners it's like one or two strokes usually but that's a wrap oh, oh and last thing i'm going to mention i think that all barbers should have experience with all three motors you got the rotaries magnetics and then there's also one i don't have to show you right now called the uh, pivot um, I think we all should try all three of them out and uh, go from there have a good night